We're gonna bend. Yeah. Oh my gosh. It is just chocolate. Mm -mm. Butter. I mean peanuts. I mean it doesn't taste as bad as it smells. Hershey's. Which would be a huge after eight. Do you like it? This is like after eight, so like something you'd have at Christmas. Hi, Hi guys. guys! I'm Arielle. And I'm Carl. And today we're doing a reaction videos to the different snacks and candies that are in the US versus the UK. So I'm from the US. And I'm from the UK, and I've brought uh, some snacks for Arielle to try. And together we actually went to the store real quick and picked up some items that are not traditionally sold in the UK and some that are so that we can compare the taste to see if they're different. So let's get started. All right, so first we have the Twinkies. I used to love these when I was a kid, so. Woo! Oh, God. <laughs> okay, let me try that. <laughs> you try it too. Why do I have to try it? I know how it tastes. I mean, I know how all these taste. <laughs> you don't have to try yours. We got a bin. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Why <laughs> do you say it like that? Yeah, they're I mean, I'm, yeah. not as good as. I feel like they changed the formula because they I, did say. I feel like as a small child, I'd love those things, but as a as an adult, an adult. Yeah. Man, that's, they like stick mm -hmm. to your mouth. Yeah, Ugh. not for me. Okay. No. <laughs> okay, so what have we got? Um. I think we've got to try the uh, the Milky Way to get going. But uh, Milky Ways are sold in the U.S. I mean, you should have bought one then. We should have compared the chocolate, but... Oh my gosh, okay. <laughs> okay, so... I feel like this one doesn't count because it's sold in the U.S., but... I can always remove them. in between don't you have them in the u.s yeah but i don't i've never well i've had milky way but i don't remember how much they taste or how much they taste how, how they taste want, but it's like um it's <laughs> yeah. well mm. on, let me just try another one <laughs> i just need to wash it down just so you guys know we have water and cranberry juice so mm. i'm gonna drink my water I'm gonna have to wash that Twinkie on my mouth. Okay, so I'm next. We're gonna try. I used to love <clears throat> these when I was a child too. So these are honey buns. I can say this not going to go well because uh, I'm not really a cake person. But <laughs> I know. I feel like all of these are sugary. I give them a nice shot. Right. Okay. That's not actually as bad as I thought it would be. Mm. It's oh. like a whole yeah, bunch of the calories. Yeah, the sugar hits. Yeah, yes or no. The initial bite was okay, but like, yeah, the sugar hits after a few bites, and I think it's just a bit too much, but yeah, I don't know. Not something mm. I buy personally, but... Um, Is it good, bad? <laughs> I feel like I'm gonna get so much hate for uh, slating on. No, I feel products. like I feel like not everybody likes honey buns. Uh, hmm. Okay. So no to the honey buns. I feel like so Callum has way more than I do just because, like he was telling me that the price of these are way cheaper than the price of these. So I definitely was not trying to break the bank. <laughs> <laughs> while doing this video so yeah i'm gonna say all, all, all these cost something like six pound fifty all the ones that ariel got i mean there's a few others but these and there's a 
few others like Snickers and whatnot, but uh, those came to like twenty dollars. Ours came, to, mine came to like six pounds something. Uh, yeah, so we move. Okay, Yorkie's pretty much just a chocolate bar. Um, Nestle, I don't know if you got Nestle. I think they were bought out by Kraft. So I feel like Nestle. I thought Nestle was American. I think it's like a praline missing. It didn't have anything in the middle. You're talking about the sugar hits. This is sugary too. I've like, not had a Yorkie for years. You can have some. <laughs> oh, thanks. <laughs> yeah, they don't taste nice, I remember. But I also used to, if I did ever eat these, I'd put these in the fridge. Mm. So they were hard and they snapped. Mm. It just tastes like regular chocolate. Like, mm. there's nothing special about them. It doesn't taste bad. It's just like chocolate. Regular regular. regular, regular. Let's do the payday. So, we're gonna do the payday. I don't think I've ever actually tasted this, but you can taste it and tell me how it goes. <laughs> oh, I wasn't expecting salt. Yeah, because it's peanut butter. I mean, peanuts. I mean, it doesn't taste as bad as it smells. The Hershey's. That's a pretty nondescript. You can't describe it? I mean, I can. It's nutty, but... <laughs> you don't even like these things. I'm not a fan of nuts. Or peanuts. I mean, it's... The, the salt hits you first, but the uh, it's definitely sweet afterwards. Yeah. The caramel, that's what, I'm not a huge fan of caramel, so that's probably what it is. Mm. Uh, do you, have you got crunchies here? I've never seen those, but. I, okay, I well, like. a crunchy is literally the name. Um, these things, it's like a chocolate outside, and then, I don't even know what you would call the middle. What do crunchy call the middle? Honeycomb. Honeycomb. Oh, it's broken already. But... Sweet. It's not bad. I would eat this. I don't know if I would like go out of my way to get it, but like if it, I would eat this. Yeah, I don't it's like good. It. Let me see what else. Like I wonder since since Callum has more snacks than I do. Um, we're gonna go kind of out of order. So I want to try the kinder, the kinder bueno because while I was in Spain, um, I tried the ice cream and I absolutely loved it. So I'm wondering if it tastes the same and if it does, I'm going to absolutely love this too. And I'm pretty sure we actually do have this in the U S and it's funny because I've never noticed it until I went to Spain, saw the kinder bueno. And then so I think she's not expecting this to be what it is. Um, it's like it tastes like Nutella. When when I had the Kinder Bueno ice cream in Spain, it tastes like Nutella. So like I feel like it'll be like Nutella. I like it. I like it. I feel like I would go out of my way to buy this. You eat it in the strangest of ways. It tastes like Nutella to me. Not Nutella. Hmm. Ferrero Rocher. Yeah. This is good. I'm going to save this one for later. So next, I want Callum to try Nutty Buddy. I feel like they were called something else. Like, when I was younger, I feel like they were called Nutter Butters or something like that. Like, but... Nonetheless, I used to love these two. Like, I pretty much got all the snacks that I used to love when I was younger that I probably don't like now. I'm still a sugar fiend, but not to this Me, extreme. Not so much. I'm, uh, I'm kind of past the sugar. Although, not as a percentage. Let's God. see. <laughs> How do I take this? Okay. Dang. I messed up my shirt. Mm. I feel like we have something similar to this, but I can't think of what it is. Do you like it? Um, I mean, I wouldn't go out my way to buy it, but 
That's not bad. It's. I could keep eating this. Yeah. Um, but yeah, it's not something I would pick up. <laughs> Left on the table. I think we should go with a whisper. Okay. He is, there's another version of this which I was trying to pick up. It's not a version of this, but it's called a flake. And uh, so this is a whisper, um, which is kind of like crumbly chocolate inside like a layer of chocolate. Uh, and the flake version, it's not really a version of this, but the flake is literally its name. It flakes everywhere and you struggle to eat it without dropping any. So this, I guess, is the sort of not so messy version of it. It is just chocolate. Mm -mm. No. Let me try it. I've not tried one for a fan. So we have a bunch of leftover chocolate, but I think we're good on the chocolate for now. Um, at least from the UK point of view. We have a few things from the US point of view that I still want you to try. Um, so let's try US, a York patty. I think they're called that. A York peppermint patty. There we go. I don't know why, but every time you pick something up, my stomach turns. That's not good. <laughs> All right, try okay. that. Okay, this reminds me of an after eight, or like a huge after eight. Mm -hmm. This is literally a huge after eight. Do you like it? This is like, after eight, so like something you'd have at Christmas. Mm. Um, after eights are something that you would have at Christmas, generally, uh, although people buy them all year round. They're usually about this size though, not this size, and they come in a big box. All right, let's try some, let's try another cakey type. So, I have no idea what this is. <laughs> these are chocolate cupcakes. So all of these were like Little Debbie breads, and uh, I guess one wasn't Little Debbie. I don't know why I got into the habit of picking up Little Debbie, but let's see how Callum feels about this. And I feel like you said you don't like cake, so. Yeah, so you want more of cake. <laughs> I know you don't like cake. Ooh. Oh wow, we got little Audi cakes. Mm. I'm gonna have to clean my teeth after this one. You don't like it? What do you think? It's very rich. Good or bad? Is that good or bad? Um, I'd say neither. It's not as sweet as you uh, thought it would be. I was expecting for an American sweet or snack, but uh, yeah, I could probably finish that if I wanted to, but I think I'd <laughs> All right. Next up, we've got the infamous uh, in the UK. Uh, these are known to everybody. Uh, this is what we call a flump, um, which is pretty much a marshmallow. Uh, I don't know if these have changed at all since I was a kid. But, uh, I imagine everything's got smaller. Maybe I just got bigger. I don't know. I'm not a huge marshmallow fan, so I'm, I don't really like it that much. But I can see how, as a child, is that a no or mm. yes? I don't like swallow, so I'm not talking with my mouth full. Um, I would never pick this up. So, I mean, as a child, but we're going as an adult. So this is a no. I would never pick this up. So far, okay. let me just say, yes. let me just say that the only item from the UK that I would actually pick up and be like, okay, I'm going to get this if I see it like, in a grocery store and I'm walking down the aisle is the Kinder Bueno. Just because it tastes like Ferrero Share and Ferrero Share is my favorite candy. Other than that, the rest of the stuff, like they weren't terrible, but they're not for me and I would never actually buy them at all. Next, and we have a Heath Bar. So this is, I've never tasted this before either. Some of this, a lot of the stuff that we picked up, I've never tasted in my life either, but I know that we sell them in the U.S. I'm not sure if they sell them in the U.K. Callum says no. Nice. So, let's try it. 
I mean, it looks nice. What like, look it? how the chocolate thing is. It's a Heath bar. Milk chocolate English toffee bar. Oh, so it should resonate with you. Shit. <laughs> 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 you can chip a tooth. <laughs> I wasn't expecting that to be so hot. This kind of reminds me of the crunchy, though. The crunchy? Would you get it? Would you eat that? Would you buy that? Uh... I'm not a huge toffee fan, so. Can you try? No. I can definitely see why people would. Tango? I mean, these aren't too popular, but um, I'll sure give them a go. This reminds me of an airhead, though. I wouldn't be surprised. Do you guys have airheads in no, the UK? No, you can buy them, but they're an import. This is like an orange airhead. Like, um. Let's try. I feel like I would like this candy if it was a different flavor. Like, I would buy this candy if it was a different flavor. I don't know about the sour part. Like, I'm not a huge sour fan. It's not fizzing, so I don't know where you're getting sour fizz chew bar. In that case, we should try this one because. That one? These are like the original ones that everyone knows about. And I think that is like the tango copy of this mm -hmm. so this is called refreshers so let's see let's see how i feel about this one all the bricks watching this know exactly what's coming <laughs> i like it well, that's lemon the other one was orange i like it i would buy this like on the days where I feel like I want sugar, I feel like I'm not gonna want candy, sugar, or anything for a long time. <laughs> and we're on to Almond Joy. So this is the last of the US uh, candies oh, that we Twix. have. We well, Twix. we have the Twix and the Snickers, but those are like compare and contrast. Like, is it mm. different? Is it the same? But I'm not usually a huge fan of nut bars. But and it has coconut in it, just warning you. The, oh, I should have brought Bounty then, but okay. Bounty? Yeah, it's like a coconut. Mm. It's like a Snickers, but with the... Mm. Or like a Mars with coconut instead of the nougat or whatever. Mm. Uh, My mom loves those. That is not what I expected. It, I expected it to be crunchy. Mm. And I guess the nut is, but the rest of it... Yeah, literally a bounty is the, is the same as the middle of this. I don't like coconut, so I'm not a fan. That's why I made that face earlier. I'm not a fan of coconut, so... I could eat this. Okay. Would you pick it up? Um, like, you're checking out, you have a sweet tooth. Yeah, yeah. I you would? Think. Okay. And I was surprised. Oh, it's not the kind check of thing. mark for the US. It's Finally. Swish. Alrighty, so let's try. Jump. <laughs> Jump. take quite a lot of chewing so that's why i don't want to start chewing it because i don't want to like i think we have something similar but i can't think of the name of the thing but for this we got the palmer violets well giant palmer violets even i do have the mini version here too but um it's the same right yeah we'll stick okay. with the big ones um, but as in the light marmite as in some people hate them some people love them so uh, the, I, these I, remind me of like Smarties. 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 Like that. The other thing in there looks like Smarties. Like those are another. fizzers. These look like Smarties too. These taste like a little. These I taste think, better than get, Smarties. I think you're getting something confused because Smarties are like M and M's. No Smarties. Mm -hmm. They're like smaller M and M's. We have to look that up because I feel like Smarties are the powdered kind of thing. Oh wait, do you have a version of Smarties here? Yeah, maybe. The last one before we try the Snickers and the Twix, ah. UK versus I US. You pull it everywhere. Dip dab. Whatever that is. I is it like these... a is it oh it's like um I always thought these were called dip dabs, but um yeah, so you're supposed to dip lick dab. the lolly and then dip it in the stuff and then 
That was probably the reaction I was expecting. I think they're supposed to be extremely sour. <laughs> oh my god, it's Ugh. that it's that when my dog picked up a lemon. Ugh no. <laughs> no garbage. So what we have left is the UK versus the US seeing if Snickers and Twix is different, um if the taste is different. Um Oh, with well, the I UK like, version versus I, the US version. I feel like these ones are going to melt if you hold them like that. So oh, really? Uh, okay, let's try the Twix. So. so we're trying the Twix first. Whew. All right. Let me eat. Let's switch. All right, so let me taste. That's the US version. I'm tasting the UK version. Do you notice either are melting faster? No, both are melting about the same. <coughs> I feel like the the fillings look a little different. I don't think it's gonna pick it up on camera, but the filling looks different. Doesn't it look browner in this one? I feel like I wanna read these ingredients out, but um for right, me, I feel, like the English, I feel like the English one tastes a hell of a lot better than the American one. They taste the same to me. All right, let's try the Snickers next. So, no more Twix. And going back to the UK one. All right, so we have Snickers. This is the US, UK. Let me see, is it skinnier? No, it looks, yours looks like skinnier. Wait, hang on, let's show them side by side. Which one's which? This one is the US. And that's the UK. So the US one seems a bit chunkier. I don't know if you can see them on the camera, but the US one seems a bit wider. Uh, the UK one seems a bit taller, but uh, I feel like you should try the US one first. And then directly compare it to that. Um, I mean that one, it tastes like a snick. I think it tastes the same. Yeah, um, if anything, the chocolate just feels a bit softer on the UK one, but... Pretty much the same? Yeah, the taste is the same. Okay, okay guys, so that's the end of the video. Well, we'll come well, up to Well, what's the general consensus? Are you UK, US? I think there's a few things I would add from the US side, but I think I'm going to stick with my UK, uh, UK candies and so on from now, or sweets even. I'm loyal to the U.S., although I will say Kinder Bueno, which we do have in the U.S., I would totally buy this 100%. And I'm actually going to go pick up another one, eat the rest of this, and then pick up another one. All right, so we're going to clean up the mess that we just made. But don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And let us know in the comments which flavors or candy snacks that you guys like and how they compare if you've ever been to the UK or if you've ever tasted a US version. Just let us know any reactions that you guys have to any of the choices that we made. So see you guys next time. Did you just drop that on the couch? Oh my gosh. <laughs> now on the floor. Oh my gosh. Okay, okay there's something chocolate in the couch. Okay. Are you gonna give me my deposit when uh, my apartment complex doesn't give my security deposit back. I'll just burn it down and claim my insurance. <laughs> better nights, better days. When you're here with me, babe. Cause you're all that I crave. So I wonder. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Don't hide away from me when I need you.